All right, well, we got about 45 minutes before live stream. Neighbor texted me, said he thought he had cow tracks in his yard, so um, came back here. This is my closest adjoining pasture, and I did have cattle in here. Came back here and did a quick inventory. I have all my cows. They're all accounted for. That's the, the back corner. is right there, the very back corner. There's a gate that goes to Scotty's place, and... I went and checked all that. The gate's up. All that's fine. I don't see any tracks there. And there's a trail that runs in the other neighbor's place along that back fence line through the fucking clusterfuck of brush there. Um, I went and checked on that. There's no cow tracks there either. So um, I'm guessing they're not tracks from my cows because typically they don't just come and put themselves back in. So probably the other neighbor's cows. Ones that are fucking starving to death and probably climbed out looking for something to eat. Because it's about that time of the year right now. Uh, they ate off all the limbs off the pine trees last year, so they don't have anything left. This is getting kind of skimpy out here. Um, but you can see in there, there's plenty of grass. And all that back in the, back in the brush. They just got to work for it a little bit, so they get kind of pissy pants about it. Um... I need to get down here. Another fucking project for another fucking day, but start brushing. And you can see the, the fence line right there that stitches in. I cleared along that fence line just a little bit to tie into the um, end of the fence line, but all this shit needs to get cleared out of here at some point. It's just a matter of time. Park my ass in the seat and Park my ass in the seat and start scooping. So Scotty just texted me something else. So um come back with you here in a second. But yeah, we gotta get all this stuff cleared out of here, just like everything else. It's nothing fucking that brush is not good for anything. All it's doing is getting in the way, and there's a few scraggly ass popples and maples and stuff in here. They'll go in the wood boiler. Um only a few trees that are actually gonna get saved around here. Kind of this big grove. And obviously the big giant oak, because that's a butte. It's a baby brother there. But the rest, most of that down in there, except for what's mature or overly mature and dying and stuff like that, is all going to stay. But everything around it can fucking go away. Every bit of it. So, I also own that fucking peninsula that sticks out there, as you can see. Uh, we might... Uh, I'm six of one or half a dozen of the other. I might fence that off too and just make this section just a little bit bigger and give them that area as well. Um, I actually got to go walk it. I haven't hardly stepped any stepped a foot out on that peninsula. Um, got to go walk it, see what's out there. If there's things that I can use for something else other than pasture, berries, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, I'd do that. But you can see there's some red pine in there, so there's some pretty high ground in there. Um, that'd give me another few acres of pasture, so. Got to weigh your options everywhere you can. But like I said, when you get down in here, there's a lot of long grass and stuff, especially down in these little draws and in the woods and all that. They're just kind of fucking picky right now. So, see it in a little later part of summer and they kind of get like that whatever they'll figure it out um obviously i'd like to have fucking knee-high grass in all my pastures this time of the year but that doesn't work right now there's some people that understand that and some people that don't um we're just doing the best with what we best we can with what we got we are going to cut the herd down so it's a little bit more manageable but as other things come to fruition i think our herd size isn't too far off but for a year or two, we gotta cut down a little bit and put a little money in the bank. So you can't keep cal keeping your calves every freaking year and expect to put money in your pocket. That sucks. Always money going out, no money coming in. So I'm gonna make my way back to the house and uh, we'll catch up with you guys on the live stream and or tomorrow. 
when this video goes up or Friday or whenever the fuck I put it up, I don't know. I'm so far behind on videos right now. Whatever. All right. I'll see you guys in a few. All right, so now we're out on the big pasture. Kind of a future plan I'd like to do here, and again, not anytime soon plan, because I always got fucking big plans and no fucking time to do it, but that section in there is where I logged last winter. That and down there a little bit. I want to get in and tip over the rest of those trees and then start working that brush line all the way back to the corner. Now it goes a long damn ways in there. So if you see, um, you still gotta go through the brush over there a little bit where it gets real black right there. That's almost my property line in there a little ways. So as you start everything and starts encroaching, you gotta go a long fucking ways back in there. I like to get rid of all that shit too. But with my mini machines, uh, it takes a little time keep pecking away at it big thing is i gotta get the excavator out here so i can come out here and bring a few beers with me and just come out here and fucking dig stumps and trees out for a while works for everybody i just put these guys in this pasture which this pasture is not too damn bad um this high area burns off for some reason but the rest of that that's not so bad that's a little bit lower lying and it's a little rough, but they like that grass. If you look over there, there's that strip right in there. Same thing. They'll gobble it up, but they're, uh, sassy. They're down in there. God, she, she browsing away, but, um, and that's just the, when I dug that freaking the cow moat on so they have all that swamp out there they just don't know it yet they haven't discovered that only the few naughty ones have so give them another probably this time tomorrow they'll all figure out that they got free rain over there and they'll all be over there freaking going to town so it'll all work won't it mr bull what do you think buddy here bud Come here. Well, come here. Come here. You want a head scratching or what? That's what you got, huh? That's your big bad beller. Come here. Dangling. Well, fine. Fuck it. Good enough. <laughs> Always something. You gave us this pasture, but we want that pasture. Blah, blah, blah. It's old diamond think. That one's diamond right there. What do you think? Dingus? She likes that grass. There you go. Get after it. Perfect. All right, well, 31. What's 31 think? 31. You want to come over for a scratch or what? What do you think? Number three. What? Not too bad for a first half calf heifer, huh? I didn't bring no treats. Is that your problem? I didn't bring no treats? Oh, yeah, I'll try it. No? All right, fine. Fuck it. Got enough. Got enough. A couple of them are putting the... Just getting... Calves are just sucking the shit right out of them. That crazy bitch. Look at her. She just got fucking crazy eyes. Her calf puts kind of puts the hurting on her. She's not that old, but she's crazier than fucking bat shit, so she's going in the freezer. She's tried to run my ass over about four fucking times now. So only one that I really have an issue with. Cows, I tell you what. 
the hell do I got so many cows? Look at them sons of bitches. Who the fuck thought that was a good idea? Katie. It was Katie's idea. I'm blaming Katie for all this shit. Every bit of it. So we got, uh, yeah, there's about half a dozen on the hit list. On the short list. There's a long list, but there's at least half a dozen on the on the short list. Oh, well. And this pasture actually comes back really fast for some damn reason. I do need to get more manure on it. This fall, probably. I mean, obviously the cows do a pretty good job of shitting on it, but need to rough it up a little bit too, I think, with the disc. Throw some more seed on it. Small area. Shit, it's only four acres. A lot of times it'll hold those cows for two days. Yeah, but fast that comes back. That's not so bad, really. They've only been off there for two days. I mean, obviously, not all of it comes back that fast, but it rebounds pretty quickly. So, oh, yeah. Make more pasture, Rick. Make more field, Rick. Make more this. Make more that. Make more time in my day, and I probably would. Anyway. All right. It's live stream time. I'm getting the hell out of here. It's time to go drink me some beer. And I ain't had a single one yet. So fuck you, Kevin.